It's your boy, Revolutionary Cuz, your favorite freedom fighter, favorite freedom fighter, thugging it everywhere. Don't believe me? Ask that bitch nigga about me. You dig? On the phone, I got Flyboy BZ, aka Flyboy305. Shit, let's go ahead and get right into it, my G. Go ahead and tell me about this diss track, Bitches, aka Stitches, and how your beef with this nigga started. Uh, that bitch nigga, um, you know, I can't really talk about how it started, cause, you know, um, I ain't trying to get anybody. I ain't trying to get cased up or anything, but you know, this bitch nigga just came out of pocket, came out of mouth, you know. Um, uh, he did, you know, he, 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 he crossed the line, you know what I mean? Like, so, I just, you know, I just want to do, uh, besides taking it when I see him, because I know y'all already seen what happens when niggas see him, um, but, like, I had to do it in the music, because, you know, that's what I do, so I just had to spit facts, you know what I mean? Definitely. I noticed that he tries to get famous off of starting internet beef with celebrities, starting with Jeezy. He got no response. Then, you know, he tried to beef with Tyga, ended up beefing with the game, ended up getting his ass knocked out. Everything he do is just fake. He's a fake ass person. Like, Lil Phil, his name, his bitch is a Lil Phil to me. Like, that nigga is a fraud. Miami does not approve of this cracker, you know what I mean? So, you don't approve of this guy. And that's real shit because I hit my peoples out there in Broward, you know, from Sunrise to my white boys out there in Coral Springs, you dig, Deep Side, Lauder Hill, Inverary, you know, niggas definitely don't fuck with him in Broward. Hit my niggas up down bottom in Ghouls, niggas out there definitely ain't fuck with him, you dig. So it's like, how, how does how is this nigga claiming to be the king of Miami when niggas in Dade, Broward, or West Palm don't really fuck with you, you dig? Yeah, he working with the police and all that. Like, he's from a spot called Kendall. I got Kendall and they don't even rock with him so it's not just anywhere down here you know all that shit is a facade he's just trying to you know get his following up but he don't know this shit real out here so you know we're gonna deal with the monkey how we deal with him you know? I like that punchline when you call him and that, that this track number two automatic you call him the white slim Jesus Miami that shit is real like niggas like this real. is fucking up the rap game <laughs> that's real you know what I'm saying it's real so the Miami Slim Jesus because we don't approve of this cracker like he needs to like just stop doing what he's doing he probably needs to like do something else like I was talking to my peoples the other day and I was telling them that this nigga's career is so fucked up he might as well go write children's books or go do gospel music or some shit yeah he should change his life and do gospel music you correct on that all the way a thousand like that's something else he should do you know yeah. We all know he can't, he ain't fucking with me or anybody with the music shit, like, so, that's for a fact, but, this man's a fraud, man, like, point blank, period. I seen your comment the other day where you took shots at presidential candidate Donald Trump, you know, you were saying not all Muslims are terrorists, which is fact, you dig, because it's not the Muslims that's, that's bombing these Islamic countries and killing these innocent children overseas. Right. Yeah, man, Salam Alaikum and all my Muslims, man. I ain't Muslim. Yeah, I respect every religion. You know what I mean? I just don't like that comment, Trump. To me, Trump is just like, he's kind of like, just like bitches. You know what I'm saying? Like, they should, like, do a track together. Like, I don't really like, I don't respect um, what Donald Trump was talking about with the Muslims. You know what I'm saying? All that, like, so I, I actually have Muslim friends from Dubai and Abu Dhabi. Like, those people are like, real genuine, you know what I mean, so all that brainwashing shit they trying to do, and even talking about Mexicans and all that shit, that shit need to go somewhere else, like, this, shit, this man shouldn't even be running for president, let's keep it honest, like, you know what I mean, shout out to Bernie Sanders, you know what I mean, vote for Bernie, so that's what I gotta say about that, check out Dobby, you know what I'm saying, like, you know what I mean. What current projects are you working on? Uh, right now, I'm just working with the team, man, GMF, we got the mixtape on the way. Um, then I'm working on my, um, my own tape, it's gonna call American Dream, you gonna have songs like Fast on there, uh, Abu Dhabi, um, a lot of new music, man, I got a lot of music, man, we just gonna, now we really gonna start dropping shit out here, man, stamping this shit out here, cause we already stamped, but now this music gonna come, so you already know the wave about to start, like, and we ain't stopping. Follow me on Instagram, that's Flyboy, F-L-Y-B-O-Y. 305 underscore, or you can follow me on Twitter, The Real Flyboy, 
And the only thing changed with the real fly boys with an I. Check the SoundCloud out. It's soundcloud.com. I pull it F L Y B O I dash number three. That's my official SoundCloud. You on the Revolutionary Cuz show. You know what I'm saying? Everything revolutionary. This is the new show that's on demand. You know what I'm saying? Check out my dog, Revolutionary Cuz. It's Flyboy Beasy, man. Checking out.